Rhesus Negative, the ancient bloodline of the Nephilim. Is it possible that, as some researchers suggest, Rhesus Negative is connected to the ancient bloodline of the Nephilim? Controversial as it may sound to you, there are numerous researchers who firmly believe the Rhesus Negative blood group is as enigmatic and mysterious as it gets and may be connected more to the stars than anyone thinks. There are those who firmly oppose the theory that people with Rh-negative blood could belong to the Nephilim, a parallel race of the human species. However, according to a number of theories, it isn't that unlikely. New theories propose this enigmatic and somewhat rare blood group may indicate non-human traits in the genetic makeup, basically meaning that Rh-negative blood is somewhat different than conventional DNA found in Homo sapiens. The Nephilim in Hebrew is translated to fallen is interpreted by many as the fallen angels due to mentions in ancient texts. Interestingly, the Bible, the Talmud, and the Quran refer to the Nephilim as the fallen angels, or the offspring of the gods. The Nephilim were in the earth in those days, and also after that when the sons of God came in unto the daughters of men, and they bore children to them, the same were the mighty men that were of old, the men of renown. Genesis 6-4 Genesis 6-1-4 tells the readers that the Nephilim, which means fallen once when translated into English, were the product of copulation between the divine beings, lit. Sons of God and human women, lit. The Nephilim are known as great warriors and biblical giants, see Ezekiel 32 hours 27 minutes and Numbers 13 33. Interestingly there are some researchers who firmly believe that there is an enigmatic truth sealed away from the public linking humans with Rh negative blood to otherworldly origins. Robert Spear provides further insight into the enigma behind Rh negative. There are 612 primate species and subspecies recognized by the International Union for Conversation of Nature, UCN, and not one has Rh negative blood. Robert Sapira, Species with Amnesia, Our Forbidden History Rh Factors or Rhesus Factor was first discovered in the blood of Rhesus Monkey. According to Sepira, if mankind evolved from the same African ancestor their blood would be compatible, but it is not. Nearly anti-five of all human beings have Rh positive blood, yet all royal families have Rh negative blood. Today, there are numerous enigmatic traits connected to this rare blood type and there are many questions that researchers such as Spare are trying to answer. Where did Rh negative blood come from? And why is it that an Rh negative mother carrying Rh positive children tries rejecting her own offspring? Is it possible that this can be explained by a rather controversial theory? A theory which suggests that humanity isn't, in fact, one race, but a hybridized species. Other theorists who share Spa's view believe that there are other traits that characterize Rh negative humans, higher IQ, sensitive vision, lower body temperature, high blood pressure, increased occurrence of psychic, intuitive abilities, predominantly blue, green, or hazel eyes, red or reddish hair, increased sensitivity to heat and sunlight and in some cases, an extra vertebra.